We are thrilled to introduce Dr. Abraham Verghese, a professor of medicine at Stanford and author most recently of the best-selling novel, Cutting for Stone. You know, I first read Abraham Verghese many years ago before I even started writing. And I was so impressed by his book, My Own Country, when he writes about coming to the United States after training um, abroad as an infectious disease doctor. And he ends up working in Appalachian, small town America, right when the AIDS epidemic is occurring. And he writes so piercingly about how this strange new disease is coming in these small towns with all these kind of strange new doctors, because most of the doctors who are in these small towns were from India and Pakistan. And he, he kind of brought out how people's um, stereotypes um, kind of overlap between race and religion and disease. Um, it, it was so eye-opening. And I remember when his novel, Cutting for Stone, came out, I was a little nervous because, you know, sometimes when nonfiction writers turn to fiction, it can be a disaster. But I finally went ahead and read it, and it was such a fantastic book. When I finished the 500 pages, I went right back and read the first 70 again. It was that good. So we're, and we're so happy that Dr. Verghese has been part of BLR's advisory board from the beginning. He contributed some stories. He's been a judge and he's been a supporter of this gala. So welcome Dr. Abraham Verghese. Hi there. It's a great pleasure for me to wish the Bellevue Literary Review congratulations on their 20th anniversary. Uh, I feel like I've been on the journey with them for much of it, I remember uh, Marty Blazer, the chair of medicine at NYU, telling me about this new uh, journal he was founding and then asking me if I had a story. And it turned out I had a short story sitting in my desk for some time that I'd been working on. And I gave it to him and it came out in the very first issue. I've been so proud to see the way it's flourished under Danielle's wonderful editorial uh, direction and won all kinds of prizes. Uh, but boy, 20 years, it just seems like yesterday. So congratulations to the Bellevue Literary Review, to all of you who supported, to the readers, and to all the many writers like myself who look to it and contribute to it. Uh, many, many more anniversaries to come. Thank you.